walk away when you still can. What happened? <laughs> Monday, we've got media, multiple types. All kinds. And we're here to see them, I guess. Yes. Hi, everybody. It's Retro Hi. Pals. Coming off a, a week vacation that wasn't actually a vacation, whatever. <laughs> it's been we a week. We didn't have water. We didn't. That was the thing, yeah. We didn't have water. We didn't feel up to streaming. But now we do have water, and we do feel up to streaming. I've funny. showered. I don't smell. Yeah, it's funny how that works. Mm -hmm. Hi, everybody. We're, Hi. I, I got to relearn how to stream since it's been a, a good long time, but hopefully you'll be patient with me. Yes. Today, Alex has prepared a special stream for us all. It's going to be Flash games based on TV shows. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Nothing but your favorite uh, Shockwave and browser-based uh, games based on, I guess, 2000s properties? 2000s, 90s. Okay. You know, the, the whole, during the whole Flash boom, you mm, know. Mm, the boom. You know. All right, before we get started, I want to thank some folks. <clears throat> thank you, Arpagot, for the 42-month resub. Thank you so much. Thank, thank you for the many numbers. months. Thank you, Hexagon Witch, 42-month resub. Ah, yes, the Hitchhiker number. Yes, two Hitchhiker numbers in a row. Wow, that's so lucky. lucky. Thank you. Yeah, it's, it's lucky, you might even say. <laughs> Thank you, Tappet Snake, 62-month resub. Early Retro Pals for the UK time zone. Yes, that welcome, is, Europeans. That is so many months. Thank you, Tappet Snake. Thank you. Thank you, JP Ronnie, 69 months. Nice. Nice. DST almost threw me for a loop, but I made my cheese on toast early enough. Good, good. Hell yeah, cheese. hell yeah. Thank you, Rocket City Rando. Nine month resub. Thank you so much. Thank you. That's a stream baby. Yeah. Oh, it is a stream baby. <laughs> Welcome, Eltrioc. Uh, thank you, Eltrioc, for the 46 month resub. Only thing better than Flash games is Flash games with the pals. Thank you. Oh, Enjoy. thank you. Thank you, Yet on the Cat. Uh, four month resub. I just got jump scared by multimedia. You're going to get <laughs> jump scared a lot. Today. It's Monday. Get ready for multimedia. Bah. Thank you, uh, Green Herring. 100 bits. Welcome. Thank you. Thank you, Maple KZ. 32 month resub. Hardy Kermit H to you. Kermit H to all. Uzi with a 64 month resub. Uz Tenda. 64. That's a lot of months. Thank you. 64 bits. Thank you, Uzi. And thank you, Bad Idea, 47-month resub. My house had no water for 10 days after Hurricane Isabel. My mother had to bring us to the house of a guy she went on two dates with once to ask to use a shower. <laughs> what I'm saying is I sympathize. Oh, yep. my God. Yep, it's hard living when you're, you're without water. <laughs> I, I sympathize. Thank you. And thank you, Taizo, 60-month resub. 60 whole years. 60 whole years. 60 whole years. And Nest Wyoming with 18 months. Thank you. Thank you all so very, very much. Thanks. Thanks, Welcome everybody. everybody. Oh, my it's, gosh, it's been so long. Yeah. I, oh, man. How do we... Uh, I guess you're just talking to a microphone, and then Alex loads up a weird fucking game, and you're, and you're like, like, what the hell is this? Stupid. Alex, you're ruining our entire brand. Everyone's going to stop watching. Yeah, that's fair. That's that's my perspective, anyway. All right. Shall we get started? Let's do it. Okay, so we're going channel surfing to play some Flash games. First oh, boy. Off, yeah, it's all gimmicky. Sorry, honey. Nest Wyoming, thank you for the 500 H's. Oh, shoot. That's a lot of H's. Thank you. What all do right, we got? Folks. What do we got first, Alex? Folks, folks. Can I call you folks? I can call you folks. We're doing uh, uh, the earliest and uh, the newest, I should say, and most complete game on the list. <laughs> it's Drew. It's <laughs> Drew Paul. It's RuPaul's Drag Race. Alex, you're gay. You can't do this. <laughs> you can't fuck up RuPaul's name. I can't. I don't. Just listening to... Wow, we're anyway. starting off strong. A, a, a RuPaul Drag Race game uh, sponsored by Bubbly? Yeah, you know Bubbly. Yeah, they had the, the series of commercials with Michael Buble. Oh, God, thank you, Chubo. 21-month reset. I hate those faces. I love those new faces. Thank you, Chubo. <laughs> All right, let's go. Sound should be on for this. Yeah, there we go. It's a board oh. game? Is this California Girls? No, it, it shouldn't get us copyright dinged. So you gotta roll the dice, and then you land on one of those, and uh, you gotta answer some trivia questions. Flash game girls are unforgettable. <laughs> All right, are we gonna be Miss Mango, Cha Cha Cherry, Lady Lime, Penny Passion Fruit, or Coco Finapple? Uh, I wanna be uh, Franny Fracking. <laughs> okay, we'll be Penny Passion Fruit. Okay. <laughs> RuPaul famous for fracking. Yeah, this game is somehow from 2006 and 2012 and 2018. Isn't isn't she fracking in Texas? Yes, in West Texas. 
All right, it should load. It, it let me play it. It let me play the whole thing last time. Mm -hmm. Nay, thank you. Please load. Thank you to Nukitsune for the 20 month resub. Do appreciate that. Thank you. It, it loaded last time. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> it doesn't load. Mm -hmm. oh a likely story, Alex. <laughs> no, it's not fair. I was gonna. I was gonna do a whole entire game of this. We were gonna answer trivia questions. Mm -hmm. oh. You mocked up an entire title screen for a RuPaul Drag Race game. I Please. didn't. I didn't fall for it. Please. Uh, uh, there we go. Okay, good. See. It's Candyland. Like, yeah, it's Candyland. Like, but <laughs> look this, at how advanced this is. This looks great. Isn't this good? These are some Xbox 360 okay, who graphics. Who is Miss Congeniality on season 12, Danny? Heidi in closet, Nikki Doll, Dahlia Sinner, Rock'em Sakura. Uh, Nikki Doll. Okay. Oh. I messed oh, it, it up. Heidi in closet. That was my that was my first guess. Okay, well, too bad. Let's we go. slayed too hard. We we went too close to the sun and we slayed we too hard. Neo, thank you to Nukitsune, 20 month resub, and Neo Zero, four month resub. Thank you so much. This rolls for you. Uh, we're going two spaces to get some delicious bubbly. <laughs> Barnacle apps. Thank you for the three months. Oh oh oh! We got a mini game. This is success. You're looking at it. And I got 100 points. Hey, I don't need to know the answers to questions after all. Yeah, you don't need no shit. And one piece. Okay, it should be easy. It's a mini question. Which queen won the Snatch Game with her portrayal of Britney Spears? Tatiana, Tyron, Pandora Box, or Morgan McMichael? I want it to be Pandora Box. Me too. Oh, no, it was Tatiana, Danny. Danny! Why didn't we do our research before this? We should have watched all the seasons of Drag Race. We really should have. This is the most beautiful looking game you've streamed on this I series. I know, that's why I'm showing it off, because it looks really good. <laughs> hey, Gort, thank you for the community thank gift you. sub. Enjoy no! your emotes. No! No! No, you went Bull! back. Bull! Bull! Yeah, Pandora Box was too busy emulating arcade games. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I got 10 points. Man, even the die is, like, beautifully detailed. Isn't it great? This game rules! Okay, which corny act play... Who did corny act play in Season 6 of Snatch Game? Fran Drescher, Kim Kardashian, Kath from Kath and Kim, or Julia Child? I wanted to be Fran Drescher. Uh, Fran Drescher. Please be Fran Drescher. It was... Yes! Yes! Fuck yeah. Yes, good. Yes. Good. Good. Fran Drescher. Broken thank Scholar, thank you for the sub. 46 months, thank you. That's so many months. I like Candyland. We should play Candyland on stream. Oh, look at my dress! Look at how good I look! Was that just like a garbage bag? Danny, that is not a garbage bag! I can't see this. <laughs> I can't see the detail in it very well. It just I got a golden like a... ticket. That means I don't have to answer one of the questions. Oh, good. Yeah. All right. Uh... Any y'all out there ever play Candyland? You ever get to the last space and get the slide all the way back down? Who was the first queen eliminated? James Mansfield, Pheromone, Aja, or Charlie Hyde? Wait, I'm thinking of Shoots and Ladders. I get those two mixed yes. up. Yes! I got it right. It didn't tell me who it was, though, which is a shame. Yeah, you gotta learn that to for know. yourself. That's unfair. Yeah, you liking the slowdown and just the presentation in general? <laughs> just, it's good! Lord Licorice was a, was serving. Uh, which season of the stars were, uh, I don't know, season three? Oh. I just, oh. I'm busy watching other TV shows. Leave me alone. Hey, Lord Licorice can get it. He really can. Lord Licorice is, like I said, serving. All right. More yeah, when fun. do we get into the chocolate factory? <laughs> Thank you, Rio. Do you say 27 months? You're telling me the Flash made these games? No! No, I went back so far! The Flash is really talented. Thank you, Rio. Do you no, I went back so far. What am I gonna do? Cartman, thank you for the 100 bits. Alex, drag her, slayer. Her. Serve. I, I will serve, serve the tea. Serve that true tea. I will. Um, Trinity the Tuck one, because that's a good name. Oh. oh, come on! Oh, you're losing more points now. The stakes I know are higher. I'm going to lose. I'm going to be like at the end of the. I'm going to be dead. RuPaul's going to come and frack our house. She's I forgot blow the it up. Gloop Monster from Candyland. We got to get Candyland on this turn. Yeah, that's the where's new... Candyland? That's the new Twitch meta. We got to get some VTubers to play Candyland. No! Alex, quit getting untucked. I'm quitting the game. If it happens a third time, I 
am moving on. <laughs> welcome, um, welcome, Cantrip. Welcome, Scarlet Swordfish. Welcome. Thank you for the 69 bits, Green Harry. This is I... the endless session of Candyland Drag Race. No, it's not endless. It will end. Alex, I'm never letting you play Gunstar Heroes. <laughs> ha! Why? We'll be at the fucking dice maze forever. Wrong. Candyland with ass made. I think that's something we can all enjoy. Okay, okay, listen. We just want ass made. Chad just wants to see ass made so they don't have to see me playing this anymore. God, I'm so close. I literally finished a game of this. Place your bets. Is Alex going to get untucked again? If I get untucked, okay. Please be normal. Oh, thank God. <laughs> My shoulders relaxed when I did that. I got so excited <laughs> I had to do that again. Alex is getting into this. I am. Mm-hmm. Uh, how do you play this, Alex? What program? Uh, this is uh, HTML5, and I'm playing this in um, Flashpoint Infinity. Yeah, look up Flashpoint Infinity. Yeah, Flashpoint Infinity is uh, super great. Hey, Karos. Yep, we're already Whoa. back in business in record time. This is Ask Me right here. I think. Thank Man. you, everybody, for the hype train. That's yeah. so many gift subs. That's a lot I mean, of gift subs. Yeah, yeah. Subs and gifts and bits and stuff. Thank you, everybody. Oh, shit. And also, Green Herring, thank you for the bits. Uh, who was the first queen ever to walk the runway? I want to say it's Nina Flowers. I got it right! What the hell? I think uh, I think I absorbed that, too, just from popular culture. Same! How did I do that? Hey, Tosa, welcome. Welcome. Okay, three queens to make it to the finale without uh, limp lip syncing. Um, yeah, they do HTML5 games. That's nice. Mm -hmm. It's good to have them all in one big uh, collection. Yeah, it's really nice. Okay, I this don't song go back. is killing me. I'm just waiting for Katy, Katy Perry to join in any second, but she's not going to show up. My girls, we're on. The... We're going to finish this. I'm going to finish this game, Danny. They're unforgettable, Alex. What were you about to say? Do you not know the lyrics? I was going to say they're all fucked up. California girls, they're all fucked up. Usually they let you actually pick your outfits, but I never got that challenge, so I don't get to pick out what I'm wearing. It's sad. You got untucked too many times. It's true. I don't think Grover's going to be in this one. I want it to be Dax! Exclamation point more than anything. Oh. Oh. I think that was a name they made up just to fool you. It is. They're like, Alex will be messed uh -huh. up with this. Huh? Lip sync challenge. Are you ready? Oh, shit. Mash the moves on the tiles. Here we go. Oh. 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 You like this? Oh. Damn. Alex, you were so close. I was. You were so close. You rank. Miss Congeniality, congratulations, Alex. The new Miss Congeniality. I am Miss Congeniality! Everyone, look at how beautiful I am! That was a weird way to end the game of Candyland. Yeah, as far as I know, Simon is not part of the original uh, formula. Well, and there you go. RuPaul's Drag Race. Race I, for the, the Candyland. I hate to tell you that. I, put, I, I front loaded the stream with that because it's all downhill from here. Oh, Jesus Christ. All right, next, it's time for the Fox Block. We are, what, we are playing hairstyling with Luann. I love Foxbox. Wait, uh, Luann, this won't be Foxbox. This will be their uh, adult animated block. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this looks All good. right, let's do it. Let's do it. We're in Texas, and we are styling up Hank. So, first of all... Um... Boss, don't cry, Luann. This is the best haircut I ever had. <laughs> oh, God! <laughs> <laughs> she just rolled an iron over his face. Luann, what you doing? Cartman, thank you for the 100 bits. You know I ain't, right? Oh, Anonymous Gifter, thank you for gifting some subs. Welcome to Sub Club, another Nomen, Theo Foe, and Infinite Candy. And thank you, Revenant, for the sub. Hank Hill's Drag Race, finally. <laughs> I think that last one looked pretty good. I like making him, I like making Luann cry. Yeah, I like the agonized cries. You like this? She looks happier there. Hank loves it. Look at how badly photoshopped her face is, too. <laughs> yeah. It's like... Totally Thank you, wrong. Seraphis Kane, for the 50 boggles. Do you like that? Hank loves it. 
<laughs> no, he doesn't like that one. I'm sorry. It's Luanne, so funny the way she Lu cries. Luann, to her credit, could make some really good agonized cries, both in the show and in this. <laughs> yeah, where's the button that emailed us to a friend? Uh, we can reset it, but no, you can't. Yo, looking good. Looking good. And that's uh, that's uh, hairstyling with Luann. Pretty fun. Pretty fun. There's, <laughs> you just do that. There's no like goals or grading or anything. Nah, it's just the goal just is making, to have fun. You're making her cry is your goal. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Next up is a game that um, it's real. Oh man, it's are we really doing this? Real. Alex briefed me on this before the show, and I said no, but he's doing it anyway. <laughs> this is uh. I promise you this is this is real. This is Bart Simpson's Naked Skate. It's been nice having a Twitch channel, everybody. We're about to get uh, hell banned for Bart Simpson's wiener. Hold on, hold on. I fucking hate the Simpsons movie. I'm What's sorry. Wrong? Okay, you don't like Spider Pig? You don't think Spider Pig is the There was, there was no good jokes made? in that. It was all like season twenty jokes. This is a real thing. Oh my god, he's three D, what? You didn't tell me it was 3D. <laughs> Cartman, thank you for the 100 bits. Thank you! I'm in danger. Fuck me, he's Blombie. He sure is. He's really Blombie! <sighs> well, if anyone didn't see the Simpsons movie, there was a big extended uh, sequence where Bart did this. And it ended in the hilarious reveal of Bart Simpson's wiener, something we'd all been wanting to see ever since Simpsons uh, was on the air. So thank you, Simpsons Movie, for doing that. Yeah, we're being demonetized on YouTube and... Thank you, Alex, for Bart Simpson's naked skateboarding. The video game. Okay, all right. <laughs> this is the stream thumbnail. <laughs> Just... Oh, it won't let me because it's... Oh! Oh, it can't update the score. Oh, well, we do have Flashpoint said no. Why is it 3D? Yeah, it reminds me of um that fucked up arcade game, Simpsons Bowling. Or like a little bit of uh, Simpsons Wrestling. That was more cell shaded I guess. But I don't like 3D Simpsons and I don't like 3D Naked Bart. Well, you're going to love this next one. Danny, it's time for the Oblongs. I love the Oblongs. Do you love the Oblongs? They used to show the single season on Adult Swim all the time. All right, you're the Oblongs, and you're here to kill. You are here to fucking kill. Finally, naked Oblongs. No, the Oblongs are, are, are clothed. Some of you not know about Oblongs? This was a... Uh... It was an adult animated TV show here in the, the States. It only got one season, I think, so you may not have heard of it. Okay, V, B, N, and M. Oh, here's Onyx. Hello, Onyx. Onyx? Onyx, by the way, the neighbor's cat, just jumped on our window and smacked it. How high did Onyx jump? Real high, at least really five high. feet. It was our, really our cat, crazy. Our cat was on the, uh, the top of the cat tree, and the neighbor's cat likes to bug him. So I literally saw the neighbor's cat jump five feet in the air and slap the window and wake my cat up. It was great. It was really funny. Okay, folks, we got to do this. I don't want to do this. Okay. Yeah, where's the moral oral game? <laughs> yeah! Ready? That's, that's Bobby okay. Hill. Yeah. Let her rip. Let her rip. You see, the Oblongs is, uh, I don't need to explain this. You can look it up. <laughs> is this neutral? Does this crap ever end? <laughs> it does now. <laughs> I don't think you landed a single hit. You threw, you threw 2,000 oh punches, and not a single one of them landed. Evo moment 38! Get out of here! I can't ban you! My hands are busy! <laughs> Rare footage of Daigo actually angry. Oh my god, you got destroyed! You got fucking owned! 
twice in a row. I'm taking away your stream badge. You, you have to earn it. <laughs> Third time's the charm. All right, here we go. I'm going to get to round okay. two. Crap ever. Let her rip. I was in a test marketing thing for the Alan Gregory show, and, and I was able to, like, uh, they, they asked for people's opinions, and I told it was one of the worst things I'd ever seen, and they didn't hear it. Did they hear it? Yes. They didn't listen. I only got paid $3. This is crap ever, Ann. Yeah, I don't remember the double cops from the show. This may be uh, an invention for the Flash game. Because usually the family is the, the one who's all like that. Well, yeah, because they are they live on the polluted part of town, so they're all mutants. Does mm this crap ever end? Hey, we got to round two! Does this crap ever end? Does this crap ever end? That should be the, the Retro Pals catchphrase. Okay, I'm going to survive. I'm gonna survive. No. People agree with you. The, the the Alan Gregory show was the absolute worst animated show Seraphis Kane has ever seen. So they're right there with you. Does this crap ever end? And that's the Oblongs. And you said you won this? It's called the Oblongs game. <laughs> it didn't look possible to win. I have three butt cheeks. <laughs> does this crap ever end? This crap does end. All right, that's the Oblongs game. Now we're going to Nickelodeon for all grown up crazy cards. Give me a second here. I have Oh, to... Fire Mountain. Thank you for the 31 months. Oh, thank you, Fire yep. Mountains. Oh, yep. God. That was your first mistake tuning into the stream. <laughs> Green Herring, thank you for the 100 bits. Does this crap ever end? It just did. Okay, I got to I think this works. Everyone got their wish. Oh, Alex, are you yeah, sure you can is, do this? This is going to be full screen, so uh, sorry, everybody. Oh, boy. Hold on. I got to figure out. <laughs> Oh, boy. Oh, this looks beautiful. <laughs> it works! Thank God! <laughs> you like this, everybody? Nickelodeon, All Grown Up, Crazy Carts. So if you're not aware, All Grown Up is the sequel series to Rugrats, where they're all grown up. This looks this looks like art to me. This looks like the, the Garfield cart killer. Garfield has his own cart racing series now. Oh, Chucky looks horrible. Oh, they all look like podcasters now. <laughs> I'm going to be Chucky then. <laughs> oh, I should have figured out how to race. Hey, here we okay, go. Here we go. Wow, this is another great looking video game. This is more like uh, PS1 quality than uh, RuPaul's Drag Race, which was Xbox 360. Mm-hmm. Hey, I'm number one. Hey, you're not allowed to go off the track. Fuck you. Alex, I'm shocked that this works in full screen and it's properly audio balanced. You really went all out for this one. I For this completely horrible, worthless game. The things I do for my stream. I'm just, yeah, I'm always ah, shocked. What the fuck? I'm always shocked when I see what 3D happened? Flash games too. Like, it shouldn't look this good. Where's the items? Where's the coins? Where's Bowser? Oh, you do get items! Hey, alright. Yeah, interesting the timer rubber is counting down. Freaking. Total rubber banding freaking freaks. Thank you! Space bar for oil slick. I just wanna. Uzi. Hey! Who jammed <laughs> me up? I'll. Get your ass in Minecraft. Uzi spent 20 bucks on Nickelodeon Cart 3 and it only lets him plays Baby Chucky and not Teen Chucky. Oh my god. I think that should be like a, an alt mode or like Rugrats Alter. They just have like a, an alternate grown up version who's like sick and twisted. Is Chucky sick and twisted as an adult? Uh, probably. Looking about, uh, yeah, this does look like a Blast Entertainment game. It's about on par with Dr. Doolittle. Does the race... Okay, I'm on the final lap, so this will end. Yeah, there you go. Rugrats Echo Fighter. <laughs> Rugrats Double Exert Underbirth Revelator. Duel 1. Let's rock. I hate this game. I hate the people who made it. They are going... Yeah, Angelica is now a rare summon in Fate Grand Order. Who did that? Angelica, you're a dead woman. <laughs> in Minecraft. In Minecraft. We, we, we would never. 
Does this race ever end? It will, it will. Dude, they're like, they're T-boning you. <laughs> they are? No! I was so close! This game is for assholes and evil! This shit's ridiculous. Come on, come on! Oh, Chucky. Oh, Thank you, Alex. Wait, you did place first. What the fuck? Wait. Uh, you win. You win. Congratulations. Look at Chucky. We, we, we looked at the tape, we reviewed the footage, and it turns out you win. Congratulations. Uh, that was... You just barely skidded past cards. Susie, apparently. Thank you, X-Keeper, for 17 months. Oh, you must sub you. for 17 months or longer to drive, it's true. It's funny, when I do that, when I play that game, it messes up all my windows and I have to fix them. <laughs> yeah, we now have to reconfigure the entire stream because of uh, all grown-up crazy cards. All right, next up is all that Coach Cretan in Cretan's Crossing. They made all that games? They sure did! I love all that. You, you know they're do? You know they're bringing back Good Burger. I heard about that. I heard about that. Uh, Alex? <laughs> it's fine. Are you, are you sure? No. All right, you real Slavic bear for the 68 month resub. It is almost a nice streak. Let me make this as big as possible. So on our screen, this is seriously like 200 by 160 resolution. <laughs> it's so tiny. We have to blow it up for you. If you've seen Coach Crean on all that, you know about his sad, miserable life. It's no wonder his happiness is a memory. Even crossing the street to go home for a bubble bath isn't easy for our poor coach. Oh. Poor coach. Let's help him out. Alex did huge air quotes when he was uh, reading that, by the way. This because looks like. It had air quotes on it. This is an Atari Lynx game. It is! <laughs> Chat, who likes orange soda? Or wait, was that more of a Keenan and Kel thing? Was it more of a Keenan and Kel thing? Hold on, let me turn this down a little bit. Did, did you hear the good news about Good Burger? I was about to tell you. No, Good Burger's coming back, right? Yeah, they're making Good Burger 2. For who? Who wants Good Burger 2? That movie's image really got rehabilitated after uh, it came out. It was reviled upon release. People didn't see it. It was a huge bomb. No one liked it. And then everyone saw it in the years afterward, and they were like, this shit's hilarious. They got George Clinton in there. Come on. Yeah, it's considered a classic. That's that's how it works. It Rocky horrored itself somehow. And this goes on forever. Hey, UHF two, not out of the question. That's right. Abe Vigoda was in Good Burger. Oh, don't! I hope it's better than Space Jam two. It would break my heart if there was a bad Good Burger movie. They'd have to call it Bad Burger. What's All up? right, my score is 35. Danny, did you like that one? Congratulations, uh, Coach Creighton. You gave me a script error and it said continue and I clicked no and it just closed it. Let's have a V for victory. All right, Danny, it's time for a commercial break. Okay. Oh, there was a book, Good Burger 2, that's now going to be non-canon. Is that what? <laughs> Good. Thank you for the V's. I'm learning all about Good Burger today. Uh, well, it opened up. Hold on. Are you sure you want to run this through Edge? <laughs> I didn't even know I had Edge set up. Well, here we go. We're taking Microsoft Edge for a test drive. Cartman, thank you for the 100 bits. Thank Welcome you. to Good Burger 2. Home of the Good Burger 2. Can I take your order, too? Capri Sun, let's go. All right. Uh-huh. So for any non-Americans, Capri Sun is a, a fruit juice snack that comes in a little pouch, a little bag, a little uh, aluminum-style pouch bag. Do you like the way the Capri Sun looks? Who's that fellow? That's a Capri Sun! No, it's not. Yes, it is! <laughs> That's your OC. No, it's not. I do not have a Capri Sun OC. Take that back. 
Uh, so do you feel like having some Capri Sun? Capri Sun got some beats, I gotta say. Mmm, delicious Capri Sun. Capri Sun's from Germany! My whole world is alive! What?! Who said that?! <laughs> it's not their fault, it's probably true. No, it's not. It's not true. Capri Why does this Sun. sound like a Nintendo game? This, this does have the sound of a Nintendo game. <laughs> like a mini game in Nintendo Land. Alex, what was the uh, fake Capri Sun you saw at HEB? Uh, cool Tropics. Yeah, we have our own brand of uh, Capri Sun at HEB. It's not even HEB sponsored, it's by some other random group, so who knows? I wish it was HEB's Cool Tropics. It's like. It sounded a little bit like Pikmin or a Yoshi Woolly World. Doo -doo -doo. I'm pretty good. I haven't even hit one of the little freaks yet. Fucked up in the crib drinking cool tropics. <laughs> Alright, doing pretty good. I don't I don't like the anthropomorphized Capri Sun pouch. You don't like its face? Why is it visually impaired? <laughs> it's wearing it's not visually impaired, it's just wearing goggles so it doesn't get. Oh, water is that what it is? Yes. Okay. I thought it was wearing glasses as a fashion choice. <laughs> Would you would you be upset if one of your favorite brand mascots was visually impaired? I died. I'd feel represented. Okay. Woohoo! Finally, again. I'm represented by a Capri Sun brag who's legally blind. <laughs> it's good to have representation. Uh, that was a beautiful little break here. Next up. All right, back to business. Sorry, folks. Next up, it <laughs> is Nickelodeon's Kids' Choice Awards 2009 KCA Rush. The Kids' Choice Awards got a game. Yeah, why not? For those unaware, Nickelodeon has its own annual awards show for kids. And it's kind of like the MTV Music Awards. Is this Binding of Isaac? No, it's, it's not loading is what it's not doing. Load. There we go. The Kids' Choice Awards. I like the music. This is this is hardcore. All right, you ready, folks? I feel like we're gonna see some blood or maybe a boob. There we go. All right, here we go. So you gotta rush because you are late for the Kids' Choice Awards. Bring the blimps to make sure that you have enough awards to give all of this year's winners. Oh, we gotta deliver the awards. Use up air to accelerate left to right arrows to lean forwards and backwards. That's right, it's one of these games. We have Minmo and the uh, the hardcore uh, new metal font. <laughs> I think that's a new record. They're usually not in the same game. It's oh. Trials. Yeah, 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 it's really hard too. Uh. Okay. We got four out of nine blimps, five. No, 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 no. Dude, sweet. No, 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 no. Green Herring, thank you for the 100 thank bits. You. As Alex reverts to primal form. <laughs> this is Elastomania for kids. It's hard. You know, I'm, I'm glad to see so many things embracing new metal nowadays. You, you hear the new 100 Gex album? I haven't. It came out this weekend. It's really I, good. I knew about that. Because people were just talking about 100 Gex. They've completed their, um, <laughs> they've completed their metamorphosis into a ska band. I think you'll be, uh, good. you'll be pleased. Alright, can I get 17 out of 23 blimps or will I explode? I'm doing good at not dying. You say new metal can stay a bit dead, but that's not your choice. <laughs> new metal Sorry. comes back to life every few years or so. Alright. Yeah, 100 Gex is just uh, Gex saying the gay rodeo line a hundred times in a row. <laughs> That's all their songs. I was gonna say, 100 Gex definitely seems like it takes place at the gay rodeo. Mm-hmm. It's what they play at the gay rodeo. That's where uh, there. that's where all their music videos are filmed. Mm -hmm. Party screamo! I gotta get into that. Uh. We keep finding newer metals. Okay. All right, one more blimp to go. Don't die, dude. The Kids' Choice Awards are counting on you. Don't catch on fire and burn to death. 
There we go. I haven't. Last time I played, I died before I hit this level. So. They're giving away extra awards. Has anyone gotten slapped at the uh, <laughs> <laughs> the Nickelodeon Kids Choice Awards? The only thing that's gonna happen to you there is you're gonna get slimed, not slapped. Oh yeah, that's what they do. I am really no no. I died. All right, and that is the Nickelodeon Kids Choice Awards KCA Rush. That looked fun. That was fun. Wow, for Kids Choice Awards, not even uh based on an actual show or even just the channel in general, they're award show God's own game. That's pretty incredible. Did Katy Perry get almost decapitated by the <laughs> <laughs> That would have been tragic. Yeah, multiple people are confirming this. Jesus Christ! <laughs> I'm glad no one's permanently injured. Anyways, Danny, do you remember Planet Sheen? No. Well, this is a game based on Planet Sheen, which was a sequel to Jimmy Neutron, so you're going to love what? it. What? There was an all-grown-up Jimmy Neutron? Well, it's not with Jimmy Neutron. It's with Sheen, uh, his annoying sidekick. I don't know enough about Jimmy Neutron to know who that is. Chat, you know, the show is pretty infamous. Oh, is it infamous for he's being a, really good? He's a Muppet. <laughs> is it infamous for being a great, amazing TV show? That's, that's Bert from Sesame Street, only he's an asshole. <laughs> Oh, people don't like this show. You don't like Planet Sheen? Then you're gonna love the game. Some good art here. Oh, it's, this is the thing. Is it a point-and-click adventure game? I love the music in this game, by the way. I'm a, I'm Bert, do something today. Bert is a likable asshole. There's a difference. Quesadillas are tasty. This looks like shit. I'm sorry. <laughs> His great, 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 great old uncle made the first quesadilla for like, George Washington. Like the actual art in the background and stuff is nice and detailed. They had artists working on this, but the character design is just... I don't... I'm not feeling this. You're apparently doing an accurate voice. Highness, I know about a giant piece of tortilla bread that lives not too far from here. Oh, the look is accurate to the show, unfortunately. Oh, you were just in a hub world. It's like Sonic Frontiers. You and your Sonic Frontiers. I love that game. I waited so long to play it, and it's like so fucking good. Anyone play Sonic Frontiers? It's it's just good. It feels good to play. Turns out, all this time, all Sonic had to do was rip off Nier completely. So, uh, the secret to this game is it's a uh, mascot platformer. Sick. Oh, is this a pandemonium-like? No, it's just regular 2D. Got up to jump. So it's Amiga. Do you like that move? What are you even doing there? That. Do you like that? Are you shooting farts out your ass? Yeah. All right. Okay. Yeah, it's the Toki Beam from uh, Okta no Ken, the fighting game. <laughs> da, da, da. I didn't learn much about that game, but I did learn how to do that. It's very satisfying. Okay, got him. Okay. This music is Blombi. This game is Blombi. Do you like it? Do you like it, Danny? They put no thought into this music. No way, this is great. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, and thank you for the Blombi sub. Thank you! A hearty Blombi to you two as well. It's good to be back in Blombi business. Do you like the udders on this thing? It had udders? I didn't yeah. even notice. Well, you should pay attention. Point them out next time. Okay. Every time I see udders now, I'll be like, hey, Danny, look. Yeah. The show was Blombie Incarnate. That's usually a good thing. This doesn't look like a good thing in this case. This show was just... All I know about this show is it's very hated. And uh, when I played this game, I was like, this is really impressive for a piece of shit. Which is how I play a lot of Flash games. everybody. <laughs> 
Are you sure you want me to do streams, by the way? Are you sure that, like... No, this is great. Okay, where's the udders? There are udders on that thing! They're green! They're udders with jiggle physics. They're, they're, those are the swinging udders. Did you ever go on the revamped Hanna-Barbera ride that was replaced with Nicktoons and ended with your machine doing the chicken dance at Universal? No, I didn't get, uh, I never rode on Jimmy Neutron's Nicktoons Blast or whatever. I never got to ride that. I never got to go to that. Okay. Jumping over and the full, okay. So I gotta... Lead the giant tortilla into the right wall. Got it. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Hey Chog, thank you for the sub. Thank you. Welcome to the world of Jimmy Neutron spinoffs, I guess. This is new to me. Okay. That's where they get the blue milk in Star Wars. Whoa! That thing looks funky. I like the way it looks. It almost, with the with the reduced frame rate, it looks almost like claymation. It does. Hey. Hey, hey, hey! Oh, you got him. Nope! There's just nothing you could do. <laughs> he chases you into a corner and you die. That's fair. I think he should be dead by now. That is one blombie tortilla. He died. Oh, he's all nicely folded now. Thanks to you, Sheen. I'll enjoy a superior breakfast. You made him into a quesadilla. There he is. Doesn't he look great? He looks like he shit. He looks like couple. He looks like Gubble. This is Gubble to me. This is Gubble. And that's a uh, Planet Sheen. Uh, been there, Sheen. That. Yeah, the tortilla ate uh, tortilla ate some cheese and that killed it. Yep. All right. <laughs> that's how, how about, quesadillas are made. What do you think about the kids WB? Is it time for the kids WB? Uh, can we just play Naked Bart some more? No, it's time for the kids WB. Okay. I don't like the title this of this is one. This the Animaniacs. I don't. <laughs> Wacko's Burp Fest. <laughs> Let's go. It, it just. <laughs> this is Puyan for sickos. It is. Is it cropped weirdly? Okay, oh, I'll yeah, fix. it is. Hold on, hold on. Hold yeah, you're on. getting an extra zoomed in version yeah, of this. Yeah, let me fix this shit. Hold on. You gotta see this whole thing. Take that. See? You're at least hearing the, the sound effects, which is the most important part. I only have I only have two lives left. Alex, is this an official game? Yes. <laughs> is there Minmo in this? I think I think there was a Minmo sighting. Do y'all like this? Yuck. <laughs> this was official. Let's play again now that the thing's fixed. Okay. Animaniacs was one of those perennial licenses that somehow existed, like Tiny Toons, how they kept making games off of that years after the show. He takes five hits, by the way. We need to add all of these sounds to a soundboard. <laughs> what are you doing? Fart, fart, burp, fart. Back here, you little freak. Tepid Snake, we played that Animaniacs game for a Mascot Friday. <laughs> that game is sick and twisted. Come back, come back. He is, he's, the burp he's, sound is disgusting. The fart sound is disgusting. Everything about this is disgusting. Hey, I got hit, but it didn't take a life. Instead, I'm just trapped covering my eyes like I'm sobbing. That's cool. What a cool, what a cool mistake. Wait, you're the cop? Yeah. My point is to try to to try to get wacko. There's a lot of games starring Ralph the Guard, by the way. I had to go through so many Animaniacs games to figure out which Ralph the Guard game I he wanted. He wasn't so much a character in the show. He was just a guy who Dude. chased them. Girl, I remember them trying to make Ralph the Guard a thing. No one wants weird. Ralph the Guard to be a thing. Yeah, Ralph the Guard. Remember, you all love Ralph the Guard at the Warner Brothers Studio lot. Something is unfolding right now. All right, final life. Well, that's it. That's uh, Animaniacs. 
Wacko's Burp Fest. How do you, looks, what do you think about that, Andy? That That was fake. You made that right before the show. You just put a bunch of really terrible stock sound effects together and made some some <laughs> some cartoons slide against the background. Well, next up is Kids WB uh, Turkey Day Food Fling. Did you make this one too? I did not make any of the Kids WB games up. Pichu! Right. You got Pichu! He's not the food, is he? He's not the food, is he? Alex? Let's play. No! He's not the food. Oh, okay. <laughs> Jeez. Okay, so you gotta get that guy. That's a Scooby-Doo villain. Another Scooby-Doo villain. We're shitting, hitting the... We're hitting the Scooby-Doo villains with what is? Uh, <laughs> what's Pichu's beef with the Scooby-Doo villains? They try to eat him. Is this documented on Bulbapedia? How does this fit into the, the Pokemon Pantheon? I hit Pichu and I got in trouble. How many EVs do you get by playing this? Don't shoot. Don't shoot Pichu or Shaggy. Why is Pichu here? I don't know. <laughs> Shaggy's huge. I know. <laughs> Pichu and Shaggy, finally. I wish it, I wish it was the uh, the musical artist Shaggy. No, it's Jackie Chan from Jackie Chan's <laughs> Adventures. Don't hit him. Jackie Chan's here too. Don't shoot Jackie Chan. <laughs> Is that a villain? I can't tell. He pops up and he's like, "It wasn't me." Good job. You know, I'm gonna do it again. I'll see if I have to see other villains. Okay. I got in trouble for hitting Jackie Chan with with mashed potatoes. Well, you would get in trouble in real life, too. Would you hit Jackie Chan with mashed potatoes in real Absolutely life? Absolutely not. I mean, at this point, he's pretty much indestructible with all the stunt work he does, but that's just insulting. I'd do it. Some people would. Some people would throw <laughs> mashed potatoes at Jackie Chan. <laughs> characters are villains and I, I don't realize it because I'm like I, I, I don't know these cartoons like I know I know Scooby-Doo because that's like a billion years old but I never watched a lot of Jackie Chan adventures I don't know who the villains are in Jackie Chan adventures like oh man I hit I hit Scooby what's my problem this is a majority of Scooby-Doo villains out here on the movie lot do you like the noises this makes it's better than the last game Not bad, not bad. All right, so it's gonna be a, a it's gonna be a, a flavorful Thanksgiving thanks to Pichu and uh, Shaggy and yeah. Jackie Chan. Okay, yeah, all right. Thank you, Sneaker Nets, for the forty-five month resub. Forty-five. Thanks for the forty-five. We're about some... to reward you with some more bullshit from Alex. <laughs> no, this is good. This is Kids WB Dash and Catch. Danny, I want you to imagine in your brain what this might be. Um. Uh, Kaboom. It's Kaboom for the 2600. No. It's not Kaboom. Whoa! Everyone's here! Yeah! Okay. S throws the ball. Nice fighting stance, Fred! <laughs> <laughs> I've seen that fighting stance in Tekken. Someone has that. <laughs> Okay. Fred is like, yeah, so, he's he's in his ready to kill mode. Danny, who do we want on our team? Oh man, okay, who's the deadliest fighters? Well, we got to have Fred Flintstone. Got to have Fred. I think Fred Flintstone should team up with uh, Yosemite Sam uh -huh. and Dick Dastardly. Oh, it's sick! Danny, guess what? It's basketball. No, it's not. It's, it's dodgeball. Yes, it is. All right. Fuck off, Tom. Tom's dead. Neketsu Koha, uh, Kunio Kun, Hanna Barbera Dodgeball. <laughs> I love Fred's hopping motion. You like this? That's like a literal fighting style. <laughs> I don't know why he's doing it. Eat shit, Elmer. This is the best I've ever done with this, by the way. I lost last time, like, really bad. You're learning. Fuck. 
So is Dick Dastardly your, your speed player, and uh, Fred Flintstone is your power? Yosemite Sam is the technique player. He does lots of super shots. So let's switch to Yosemite Sam. Good going, Yosemite. You should have just shot him. I'm always saying that! Great, great, good job! Why doesn't Yosemite Sam just shoot Bugs Bunny to death? <laughs> he really should, though. Plot hole. Fuck, I don't know if I'm gonna get this. Okay. Why doesn't Fred Flintstone have some kind of rock gun? Fuck. Fred's special is up, I don't know what this is, but it's gonna be cool. Nice. His special is he just throws the ball at your face and you die. Oof. I might do it! Alright, Dick. Deliver the killing blow. Fuck. You missed! Yeah, Fred's got a Hisatsu ready. <laughs> oh my yes! god. Yes! Fred Flintstone, Yosemite Sam, Dick Dastardly. The trio to win the dodgeball tournament. Good work, Alex. <laughs> You kicked everyone's asses. Oh, I just let you replay. I thought it was actually going to do a like, play a replay to inform me. Simon, thank you for the 100 bits. Thank Fred you, Flintstone buys a rock gun and a rock silencer. <laughs> Calls it his Yappa Dabba Downer. God damn it. That's let's, good. Let's reboot uh, Fred Flintstone. Just him. Okay. Next up is, uh, you know what? It's time for another ad break. Danny? Mm hmm. Uh, you're going to love this. Oh, man. Alex! There he is! <sighs> no, let's restart this. Hold on. No! Yeah. That wasn't... That couldn't have been him. It's me, Carrot Top. It's him. It's Carrot Top. Carrot Top. No, third time's the charm. Hold on. Alex. It's me, Carrot Top. There we go. <laughs> Alex. <laughs> play out of play. You dial down the center to start the game and get your first delivery of snow. You score points by hitting with snowballs. You used your mouse to move. Make snowballs by moving to the snow pile and holding down the mouse button. The longer you hold the button, the bigger your snowball gets. Bigger snowballs move slow more slowly, but score more points when you connect. More like chairman of the board, Rip Norm MacDonald. <laughs> oh my god. C A L L A T T. Alex, do you know how much money I racked up in phone bills calling you when you were in California? <laughs> yes, I do. I'm so sorry. I missed. Darn. God. Yep, before I, I imported Alex into Texas. Yeah, I still He was a Californian. And uh, way back when, you didn't have Discord, you didn't have Skype. You had to call up your, your, your sweetie on the phone. You get a million dollar charge because you talk to him every night until five in the morning. Yeah. No! I'll get you next time. I did eventually pay it off. I'm proud to say that. It's me, Carrot Top. It wasn't no, <laughs> from any me. thanks to Carrot Top. I'm glad they make you enter the number. That's very mimetic. It is. I hate it. It encourages you to do that in real life. <sighs> yeah, remember long distance calls? Oh yeah, ten ten three two one. Man. Oh, what if you try dialing something else? Can you do a fake nine one one call? <laughs> oh shit, I should. <laughs> Let's try that. Let's try Let's that. Let's get Carrot Top arrested <laughs> for for doing a fake emergency call. <laughs> oh, I won't let you hear things. It just lets you do. Uh, 1 800 call ATT. Rachel Retro. Thank you. 62 months, more of an 8 1 800 collect lady. Yeah. Yeah. There was a whole lot of options to get ripped off for long distance phone calls. Thank you for the sub. Last try. It should have Easter egg phone numbers. Like if you spell out fuck you, it gives you a free, uh, uh, I don't know, free porn. Danny! <laughs> Hey, it's me, Carrot Top. I'm naked now. I missed. Sorry about that. Hog, how dare you? That was that's an assault to my senses. First of all, thank you, Cartman, for the thank hundred you. bits. I do remember prepaid phone call, 
of cards, but we had a baby eats a boy. <laughs> do you remember that? I do remember that. Oh, boy. I was telling someone this the other night, but do you ever get pissed off that, like, so much of your brain space is dedicated to commercials and shit? Yes. Darn. I'm bad at this. I'll always remember we had a baby eats a boy. Won't remember birthdays, won't remember names. The ladies. <laughs> well... I'll get you next time. I suffered and died. I'll get you next time. Hi, I can't I can't believe you found a fucking carrot top game, Alex. Is there a problem with that? There is a problem. First it exists. Wrong? Second you streamed it. Now everyone knows about it. Uh, well, uh, you'll like the next game. It is uh it's Scooby Doo Ghouly Groovies. We only remember the important things, yeah. Like uh one eight hundred call ATT and Stone World World War Two. And so on. The, on. the Sears air conditioner commercial. <laughs> Looks like it's going to be another scorcher. Cool. You, you'll be happy to know this loaded earlier. It's the curse of the stream. It is the curse of the stream. You'll call now? I'll call now. Oh my God. You have to tell me if there's a Dennis Miller game in here. There is not. Okay. Well... Well, well, well. It looks. Let me. Let me try again. Try reloading it. Yeah. 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 It did work earlier. Come on. Come on. Now we'll just have to skip this one, which is fine. No. Which is fine. No. Now it won't even connect. It's just like no. I heard what you were saying, and <laughs> it's just like nice. not even loading. We had to skip this I'm one. I'm gonna try one more thing. If you hear a uh, banging outside, they're doing construction on us. Try restarting the launcher? They're no. doing a they're doing a retro pals repair. Yeah. Alright. So we skipped on that, but it was just a rhythm game. There wasn't much to it. You didn't Aww, much. But the the ghouly grooves. Alright, next up is a game. Uh Danny I want you <laughs> That's not real. This isn't real. No, it's no. totally real. No, 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 no. You don't think oh funny game. This games is some homebrew game, game made by a sicko. <laughs> Oh, Funny Games presents, I can't believe I'm saying this, Simpsons Prison Break. This is real, don't worry. That's not real. Okay, come on. You're, you're fucking with me now. <laughs> Leggy Bart Simpson. You like Bart? <laughs> you like very tall Bart? Long leg Bart Simpson. You're gonna love this. Tip to Bart. toe, that's a Bart. You're gonna love this. How to play. Down, slides, right, jumps in between, up, okay. Slacks. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now this is more what I was expecting from Alex today. <laughs> Leggy Bart. It, it reminds me of- Oh my god! His limbs are sprawled all over the place. It reminds me of when they made that uh, leggy Mario in 8-bit style. Ooh, this time it's Bart with gigantic legs. Look at the gams on that guy. It's basically clopped with Bart. It's Blom Bart. I'm doing pretty good. You think this would have gotten voted down on Newgrounds, or would they have like eaten this up? They would have totally eaten this up. Yeah. Alex, how did you find this? Was Does it just it in the Was it just in the collection like it's normal? Yeah. That's fucked. Flashpoint is great. It's filled with stuff like this. I did it. I beat a level. Nice work. Your long legs paid off. Now we all know it's a popular subplot in The Simpsons. Uh, Bart's leg stretching exercises. <laughs> His main character trait is uh, <laughs> is when he collapses on the ground, he looks horrifying. This, more time. Is, this is another one Alex made. Don't worry about it. No, someone else made this. Bart, die. It doesn't matter. Yeah, the score counter is pretty optimistic, huh? Boink. Time to do a marathon play of this. 
Mm -hmm. Streamers, this is your new game. I specialize in marathon playing uh, Robotron and Simpsons Prison Escape. Why is he in prison? That's... The legs really threw me off. The, there's a prison element to this as well. Yeah, it didn't... Yeah, yeah, him having long legs is bothersome, but... There's a lot that's bothersome here. Oh, that's too good of an idea. No one's done that, of course, making uh, Clarissa's game in Flash. Like uh, the Amiga game she makes. This is where the Patreon money's going. Yeah, Alex is secretly commissioning all these twisted games <laughs> to disturb you. Do you like it? Do you like what I'm doing with our money? Yeah, there's there's worse. There's worse things you could do. <laughs> yeah, gotta up your pledge. <laughs> this is the kind of quality you can expect. I'm into level three! Danny, what do you think of me now? I think they need to upgrade this, release it on mobile, and it could be the new Jetpack Joyride. I agree. What was he in prison for? <laughs> Why would they- For this. For this. This is what he was in prison for. They just saw him out on the, the public streets of Springfield with those horrible legs and arms, and Chief Wiggum was like, oh, we can't, we can't allow you to exist in public, Bart, sorry. All right, now we're going into the wild world of syndication, Danny. Danny, mm -hmm. it's time for Xena. Well, we've played nothing but good Xena games on this stream. <laughs> Every Xena game we we played has been a a real, <laughs> a real fucking winner. In this three level adventure, you play the role of Xena, warrior princess. Your sidekick Gabriel has been kidnapped by Callisto. No. Yeah, our most despised adversary. Uh, Gabriel's being held prisoner in a castle beyond the barren wastelands. Your task, as Xena, is to brave the hazardous journey through the trap-laden wastelands and raid Cast Callisto's castle. Upon entering the castle, you must uh, then defeat Callisto's four best warriors. Finally! You must venture into the dungeon to confront and conquer Callisto herself and rescue your loyal friend, Gabriel. Uh-huh, loyal friend, yeah. Loyal friend. This is something easy. Ugh! Xena jump scare. <laughs> All right, this is looking good. This is another one of those games that's like 200 by 160 resolution on our end. Oh god! There's too much words. Just jump in and start killing people. Okay, okay, okay. You, Xena. Let's go. Me, Danny. Whoa, 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 Xena. Z Xena, you've had way too many energy drinks today. <laughs> Nothing stopping her. <laughs> Jesus Christ! I can't wait for there to be a foe in range. <laughs> Got the zoomies. Do you like that, this, this, this is excellent. This is the best Amiga game I've ever seen. <laughs> yeah, we gotta press the turbo button on the, the flash menu. <laughs> to make it slower. Now you must defeat four of Callisto's best warriors, each more challenging than the last. Oh man, here's where all the... oh boy. Alright, let's do it. Remember Action Pack? I guess so. Online, Online adventure. adventure. The castle. Oh, now this looks like an Amiga game. This is some Defender of the Crown shit. Or like a Barbarian. I should look at the instructions. I don't know how to. <laughs> I was just pushing every key on the keyboard trying to fight. Walk away while you still can. <laughs> Wow! <laughs> this game's a laugh a minute. I love this. <laughs> the way he just fucking zoomed out of there. Space bar! Really? I was pressing the space bar! <laughs> okay. Whatever, whatever, whatever. Yeah, he's going on his own legendary journey, this guy. Walk away while you still can. What happened? 
because <laughs> I didn't have any points. So basically, because I have no energy left, every time I start the level, I think I'm gonna just. Die. Oh my god! It starts you at zero health. <laughs> Okay. I'm gonna try one more time, but I, I don't think I'm beating this level. Okay, we got this. Let's go. Oh no, you got zero health again. It's fine. Okay. <laughs> I don't think we're getting the Callisto. Not today. Sepasai, hello. Thank you for the bits. Welcome to maybe the best Xena game we've played on stream, technically. It's not the Multipath Adventures game. It's not the PS2 game. I beat an enemy. Do I get something for that? Oh, you don't even get your health restored. No. Walk away while you still can. Meep, meep. Walk away while you still can. And that's Xena. That is what the end princess. of Xena. Oh, we did play the N64 Xena fighting game. That was pretty good. This is, um... Uh, well, it's less good than the N64 fighting game. Better than, uh, the PS2 game. I'm not sure how the, uh, Multipath Adventure ranks. Please close. We're the Xena streamers. Wow, this window refuses to close. You gotta Control-Alt-Delete? Yeah. <laughs> No, no, okay. We fixed it. We fixed All right, it. Good. We fixed it. Okay. Next up, we're watching Cable Baby. It's time for uh, Showtime's Bob and Weed. I have never heard of this. What the hell is this? Thank Nanaki you. Amano, thank you for the sub. Thank you. What's wrong with the house? Is it the plumbing? Uh, oh, God. Don't get me started on the plumbing. <laughs> thank you for the on. sub, though. Bob and Weave. Do you like the way they look? No. No, can't say I do. Okay, so this is just a game where you uh, try, to, try to punch the other guy. Fair enough. Huh? <laughs> it's fine. Uh, Alex? Hit you right in the nuggets there. Whoa, hey. Hey, here we go. Oh, man. Frank Bruno versus Mike Frank Tyson. Bruno what? versus Mike Tyson. <laughs> Forget these two losers. Everybody tune in for the pay-per-view event of the year. March 16th, 1996. <laughs> Was this really promoting pay-per-view? Yes, yeah, promoting uh, boxing pay-per-views on Showtime. All right. Okay. Yeah, all right. I'm gonna tell my kids this was funky head boxers. Um, I think he died. You jellified him. Moving on. It's you time turned him for into the jelly man. Danny, it's time for Bob and Weave 2. Bob and Weave 2? We don't need a Bob and Weave 2. We didn't need a Bob and Weave 1. It's fine. Yeah. Okay. So now it's first person. No, I want. I want. I want to. <laughs> Alex, give him the chainsaw, then give him the beans. <laughs> That's beans. I want to see what the beans do. I, I'm sorry I said I wanted to see what the beans do. This is so multimedia. They threw beans at him. They threw beans at him! <laughs> Alright. Do you like this? I don't know why this exists. I don't know who this is for, what it's promoting. Well, I guess I do know it's pr what it's promoting. 
Hey, big boy. Oh, oh, forget these two losers. <laughs> Honey, we've got Bruce Seldon and Mike Tyson coming up on Saturday. <laughs> Screw these guys. <laughs> Set your VCRs. Oh. Oh. Oh my god, I wish you would stop giving him the beans. I don't like you drilling him either, but... I killed him. Good. Bob wins! Not a good day for Weave. Credits! Who worked on this? Name yourselves. Tab, Steve, Patrick, Howard! Uh, all of you! Go to hell! Tab Noble. And that was Bob and Weave, too. But first, Danny, it's time for another uh, commercial break. Okay. Danny. Dear. Do you remember Pepsi Jazz? What's Pepsi Jazz? <laughs> it's not just for musicians anymore. Jazz? Oh, you know this, Dark Tetsuya? Apparently this is known, this, uh, this game. Play me. Play that Pepsi like a marimba. Alright, let's go. Oh, alright. At least there's a freestyle mode. Yeah, I like that. Alex, you haven't answered the question, what's Pepsi Jazz? It's a soda that no longer exists. What's that new one? Pepsi Nitro? Danny, you're thinking of... Yes, that does exist, and I know what you're thinking of. I... I... I do you want me to buy you some sometime? <laughs> I just wanted to see you talk your way out of this one. Diet Pepsi Jazz was an American brand of soda introduced by the Pepsi Company in 2006 and discontinued in 2009. So apparently this was a diet product. Jazz, I forget what the flavor was, but yeah. All right, see you around, Tepid Snake. There were zero calorie dessert themed flavors. Jazz was, okay, so it's like sweet, sweet, sweet Pepsi. Uh, Ultima, thank you. 200 bits Pepsi mo money nitro only on TNT. <laughs> I think that's enough jazz xyl xylophone for us. But yeah, Pepsi jazz. I can't believe it's real. Me either. I think all discontinued sodas could get, should get their own game. Is there a, a Pepsi Blue game? There probably is. I haven't looked. I should have looked. Uh, next up, it's more Bob and Weave. No! What? What's wrong with that? There's the, they can't have made three Bob and Weave games. They didn't need to make one. Why not? The legend continues. It's a two-player game. There's more Bob and Weave. I'm, I'm good. Okay, JK and L. Punch, low punch, and block. Got it. I'm gonna make you my girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> ah, so this is a dating sim. <laughs> a dating sim where all you do is punch a guy in the nuts. <laughs> all right, folks, tune in. Oh boy! For the it's next. Mike Tyson oh my the God! It's the famous Holyfield no, fight. No, it's not. I actually checked. This oh, it's the not. One before. Yeah. Okay, this wasn't the famed one where Mike Tyson went nuts and bit off his ear. That was 1997 where uh, that happened. <laughs> I did check before because you, you can. I'm glad you did your research. Let it never be said we don't do our research here on Retro Pals. Yeah, because the fight was Mike Tyson versus Evander Holyfield 2. Yeah. Where it happened. So mm -hmm. that was one. Thank you, Blur, for gold for the five-month resub. I will punch nuts in uh, in honor. <laughs> Thank you for the five months. I'm sorry about what you're seeing. What, you don't like this? Oh, Bob's poor nuts. I'm just trying to win. Is this how you're making him your girlfriend? I won! I won! I won by punching in the nuts! 
Good work, Weave. Weave wins by nuts. Folks, it's time for Bob and Weave 4. The Thrilla in Digitilla. No. Yes. No. What? You're not going to stream the fourth Bob and Weave game. Why not? It's going to turn out there's going to be like 11 of these, right? This is the final one. Really? You yes. promise? I promise. You promise this heart. is the last one? What? Why you're all... See, now it's not loading because of you all... Oh, there we go. <laughs> Thank you. The Thrilla and Digitilla. Bob and Weave 4. We're back to first person. Wow! You melted him! It's fine. Buh! Loser! Loser! Ultimo, thank you so much for giving out five community gift subs oh, for these you. these horrible games. <laughs> Welcome to the sub club, everybody. Enjoy your emotes. Uh, we need some bob and weave emotes, I think. That's what the people are clamoring for here on Twitch. Yeah, we've progressed to murder. It, was, it started off as a nice boxing match, and now we're just... <laughs> I don't know about these animations. Shuns. I don't know about them. Folks, tune in for the event it's of the century. Banner, it's a Holyfield Mike Tyson too. <sighs> That's the one. That's the one. That's the event you want to be promoting. <laughs> Vander Holyfield Mike Tyson too. It's gonna be a muncher thing, Cartman. <laughs> Gonna be a real ear biter. And this is that is that why this was the last one? Could be. <laughs> is Bob and Week Five just a full screen? Sorry. <laughs> yeah, the fight was on June. Here's the thing: the fight was in June 1997, June 28th. This advertises an Evander Holyfield Mike Tyson uh, per match on July 8th, which would have been after um, Mike Tyson was banned from boxing, so it, it, Wait it was a, minute. a boxing match that I don't think ever happened. What's what's going on here? Yeah. You got an ad for a prototype unreleased boxing match? The Bioforce Ape of boxing matches? They moved the match up? Okay, either they moved the match oh, up or okay. it's a match that never happened. That could have yeah. been it. Well, you could play this and you just have the wrong date. You wouldn't get anything from this. You would watch it on the wrong date and you wouldn't know what would have happened. You'd be misinformed. I hurt you, sweetie. That's the Bob and Weave saga. Which, by the way, when, when I saw Evander Holyfield Mike Tyson 2 pop up, I fucking <laughs> lost my mind. I, would have lost I made my shit. many screams. <laughs> So, I'm glad I'm glad that that had the promotion it deserved. We're moving on from Showtime to HBO, baby. Yeah. It's uh it's uh, time for Sex in the City. Sex in the City the Flash game. Yeah. What do you think's going to happen? I know there's nothing I can do to stop this. No, sorry. I could get up and unplug the computer, I guess, but You could. It's too much work. Is this official? Is this unofficial? I don't think it matters. Hmm. I think all that matters is that we're playing a, a, a Sex in the City game. Hmm. <laughs> That's true, X. <laughs> he's, he's very considerate. Once again, I promise this worked when I tried it. It is not another Bob and Weave game, I promise you. This isn't a quiz either. <laughs> this is not a quiz. Bob and Weave 5, Sex in the City. It will load. I think we lost the uh, the Sex in the City stars if they, after they saw Bob and Weave. You think they, they, they decided not to? Yeah, they, they bowed out. That's a shame. Cause it's a good game. I really, it was a really funny game. Let me, let me Want to relaunch? Again. Yeah, let me try again. Come on, come on. 
It does give you an option to play a quiz game at the bottom. I am not playing a quiz game. <laughs> Alex has standards. I do. Well, now it's working even less. Aww. It doesn't even cut to the intro screen now. It's just a blank screen. If you want to know what it was, it was a kaboom like where you had to catch falling items. They did make a kaboom like. I just yeah. guessed the wrong game. Yeah. Oh man. You got to try that again at some point. Okay, we're we're uninstalling and reinstalling. Last try. Nah, this isn't. No. Good. No. Sorry. Sorry, folks. No sex in the city. Next up, I, uh... Next up is another game where you have to decide whether it's official or not, Danny. Okay. All right, let me put on my, my gamer glasses. All right. Okay, if this is I'm going to observe this like a fine jewel. Point. I'm going to see if this is official or not. It I looks like you got to restart. Yeah, I got to restart Flashpoint. Hey, that means we may be able to play Sex in the City, so that's good. Ooh. Yeah, yeah. Hold on. I got to grab this real quick. Folks, 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 thank you for bearing with us as, uh, as we do this, as we show off these delightful Flash games. Sexless City. No sex. No sex in the city. It's not zoned for it. Okay, let's try Sex in the City again. Let's, let's have some sexy city. Please work. There we go. All right, sexual city time. Hey, it worked! Oh my god. So, which of the girls are you, Danny? Um, I'm uh, the bitchy one. I'm the slutty one. So, do not get the sensible shoe or it's game over. <laughs> Is this official? This looks official. This looks like it would be official. It does, doesn't it? I don't know if it is. I still haven't figured it out. It's That's got why that. I asked you. It's got that kind of psycho brand energy to it. It does. Avoid the sensible shoes. And then they like they really pummel the shoes at you. <laughs> Sarah Jessica Parker BMP. <laughs> She's so happy. Oh, I got a shoe. She's just an anthropomorphized shopping bag. I think some people are into that. Excuse me. If not, that could be a new uh, cutting edge finish. Girl, make me your shopping bag and put items in me? Yeah. That's not too outlandish, is it? It's not. That's... Maybe there's a way we can capitalize on this. How can we turn this into a grift? Who out, who's out there wanting to be a, a sensible shopping bag for Sarah Jessica Parker? Post your bag, Sona. Post bag. Ah, how's I supposed to avoid? There's like 20 sensible shoes there. <laughs> all right. Well, that's working. <laughs> Good. That means that all the other games are going to work now, too. Good. Unfortunately, it does, which means you have to see Simpsons uh, Toku. Simpsons Toku. Alex. Hold on! Alex, I don't think, I don't think, I don't think this is you official. You don't think this is official? I don't think this is you an don't official You Simpsons game. Toku is official? Hold on. I don't. <laughs> Put it in H. Photographing a TV screen. Ah! Thank you for the 100 bit sign, and I also agree that we need non sensible shoes. Oh man, Spider Pig, finally! Oh god, yeah, he builds a silo, silo full of Spider Pig's shit. You think this was a, a pitch to the Simpsons studio? Yes. Like, I can make you a Flash game. I can make it nice and good. This guy saw a naked Bart uh, skateboarding and was inspired. Alright, I'm pretty good so far. Why is it Spy Hunter? Because it's a 
Simpsons Toku. What's Toku? I don't know. What's Toku with you? <laughs> I want a Toku. So far, so good. The what? title of this is Gonky, which means race. Thank you, Code Man. Thank you. Thank you to people who are, can actually translate this. I was I, I was also thinking Tokusatsu. Simpsons Crystal Skull Vodka. The skull is shaped like Homer's head. Right. What noise did Alex just make? Alex makes a lot of noises. I, I Noise man. I am a man just composed of noises that get randomly squeezed out when my mouth opens. Simpsons Goncharov. Uh, in Japan, this is called Battle Formula Hit and Run. Thank you, Strawberry. Thank you. Good. So far, my toku's going good. <laughs> Thank you for the screen cap, Mr. Taco. That intro was the best part of this. Did you like the intro? Mm-hmm. I wish there were more intros. They were just like... <laughs> photographs of TV screens with uh, word bubbles in Russian. Got 13 seconds left. Can I make it? Let's go. No, no. Let's fucking go. Eight. Seven. Six. six five, five. Four. Three. three. Two, one. Yep, er, hate Yixen. I failed. Happy New Year, everybody. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's Spy Hunter and Road Blasters. They take all the inspiration from the classics. A uh, good game, Alex. Definitely good official Simpsons game. One of one of my favorites. Okay, next up, we're on the Fox Box now. I have bad news. These are the worst games of the bunch, so enjoy. <laughs> okay, good. <laughs> yeah, I just imagine cutting to Krusty and he's saying, what the hell was that? So, remember Ultraman Taiga? No. It's a Lunar Lander clone? How many of these have we played? <laughs> Kaboom, you died. This looks like it sucks. But at least it has the theme song. Whoa, 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 he's an Ultraman! Get your man with the boots and the Ultra... <laughs> Ultra Yeah, just like I remember from the 60s. It's good, it's normal, it's fine. Is this what the show was about? Them constantly failing to land? I didn't know that an English Ultraman theme song existed, though, and I'm really glad to be hearing it. Do you like it? I do. This sounds like Bootleg Crush 40. I did it! Ooh, oh my god! He about to do it. Nice work, Alex. I beat level one. Ultraman. For a hero. Searching for a man. Australian Ultraman, that sounds cool. I miss this quality of MP3s where it was sounding like it was over a shitty radio. It's the kind of music you would download over a dial up modem. It is kind of appropriate when you consider tokusatsu shows uh, take place in a lot of quarries. Nice, nice. That was hard. That one was really hard. I've not beaten this level, so. Why? Oh, you think this is AU format? No way, this has got to be real media. <laughs> this is an RM file for sure. 
I like the part where he goes, Ultraman. Same. And I also like when they're searching for a man. Same. Fine. This is getting me hyped up. I want to go for a run. Or maybe a lunar landing. Search for a hero. This is really hard, by the way. This is like one of the hardest Flash games I've ever played. This is a game for children, by the way. Why would you do this to children? Ultraman! System of a Down Ultraman theme.mp3. It looks like there's a shit ton of lag, is that true? Yeah. Oh my god, Alex. How did I do that? Alex, you could be a surgeon. You know, with this kind of precision, there's a there's a game you should play. No! It's a, it's a black screen and there's a little blue maze. And you gotta really focus to get through to the end. Are you okay? <laughs> Pixel. You have successfully your mission! You successfully died! So, I want you to notice something about these games that we're going to play. Um... Ultra! They have a very interesting quality to them. And that quality is... Oh no, did I not include this on my list? Oh, there it is. The quality is... The what, twins? <laughs> Don't worry about it. Hey, Danny! <laughs> hey, chat! Remember the cramp twins? No! The fuck is this? Honey, it's the cramp twins. No. Remember the cramp twins? No, quit trying to make the cramp twins happen. This is yeah, your own... You know the... Uh-oh. You drew this before stream. No! Do not remember the Cramp Twins. Rachel hated this, so this does exist. It does exist. Hold on. This is Canadian, apparently. Fake and or British. That's, that's also my guess. There we go. Even British people will remember this. The fuck? <laughs> How did I completely miss the Cramp Twins? Canadian and aired on the Fox box, eh? Yeah, this was a, ca a Canada joint. <laughs> Made you stop watching TV. Really? <laughs> yeah, the thing I know about the Cram Twins, I, I never watched it, but I know it's uh, very reviled, so I'm very excited to see how this goes. This looks like it would what? be... What? I didn't even play! Wow, good work, Alex. You got a thousand points. Control Tony with the left and right arrow keys. Get under the falling junk to This makes me it. sick to look at. <laughs> However, be careful because gonna... some of the junk takes points away. This this game is going to make me throw up. There's Minmo again. There's Minmo all over the place. <laughs> it's Kaboom again. <laughs> or excuse me, uh, Sex in the City. This is a Sex in the City clone. <laughs> I like the jaunty little dance up there. Mm-hmm. Oh, watch out for the sensible shoe. So yeah, it's the Cramp Twins, folks. <laughs> the Cramp Twins don't deserve sound. No. Never watched the Cramp Twins. It was always one of those shows that aired that I looked at it and I was like, I don't want to play. I don't want to watch this. This is a plug and play game. Oh, that'd be a good Flash game. Kevin McAllister dropping bricks. On Harry and Marv. They could have done that. They should have done that. Alright, we got eight seconds left. Can I can I get a high score? There's something really cursed about one season cartoon shows. <laughs> like they had this all animated, all this these characters planned out. They thought the Cramp Twins was really gonna do it for them. So what do you think of the quality on these Fox Box games? They courses? suck ass. What the fuck? Are these some of the worst Flash Fox, games you've Fox ever Fox has seen? money. Fox has money, and they're making games that are barely better than Simpsons Prison Escape. Yeah, Simpsons Prison Escape makes this... Like, this looks like... Sim this, this makes Simpsons Toku look like fucking 
Like an adult swim game or some shit like that. Ultraman. Yeah, what do you think about that? Ultraman. Okay. Okay. Searching for a hero. Are we? Searching for a man. With all the right stuff. No. So, you gonna watch the Cramp Twins after this? Mm, gonna look them up? I don't think I've been convinced. You, you don't, I mean, that's what this was made for, to, to convince you to watch the show. The Cramp Twins. <laughs> there we go, it's the Cramp Twins. <laughs> nice, nice. Good work, Foxbox. Glad that you put $10 towards your Flash Games uh, funding project. Oh no, I don't want to play this one. What are you, what are you planning? It's an ultimate muscle game. Yeah. Okay. Um, I'm gonna tell you. Alex. I don't know why it's not loading. I'm banning Alex for this one. You can't see it yet, but I'm banning him. I, there we go. I double banned you for this. It's Ultraman! Ultra Muscle! Ultimate Muscle Gassy Gallery! Gassy Gallery Shooting Gallery! Kid Muscle might not have guts, but he certainly has lots of gas. Uh, Kid Muscle can't control his gas, but you can. <laughs> Use a space bar to fire a fart at the bells. You can move Kid Muscle with your mouse. It's the same game! You're just... <sighs> How is the music loop this short? How is it this short? So, what do you think of this Foxbox game? This is the worst thing anyone's ever made. They just didn't care. It makes you yearn and pine for that, uh... Dodgeball game we played earlier, yeah? I'm yearning and pining over here. Ultraman muscle. It's ultimate muscle. They're not saying Ultraman muscle. I'm sorry. They've only repeated it like 50,000 times already. <laughs> Van Danny, why? What did Danny do? What did I do? I got caught in the crossfire. The actual OP apparently fucks. Bean. This does not fuck. I'm around. Why? Why are you? <laughs> why do you? Why do you hurt me so? That's Bean. I want a really high score. Come on. Is there a? Is there a flash game based on four kids, one piece? I want to see that. Oh, you can hit him multiple times. You found the tech. Alex with the tech. He's going to win this gonna one. Get higher than 28 this time. You got to rapid fire those farts. You actually do. That's a secret. Got to have a machine gun ass. Simon, thank you for the 100 bits. Okay, so Ultimate Muscle was originally associated with Ultraman. Okay, so give me give me money. All right, I'm giving Alex some credit here. Thank you. You get a little bit of credit. Mm, mm, man, I'm kidding. Hey! I'm gas, but pretty good. Alex, that was cabbage. Thank you. Nice work, I think. Oh, God, I was just being pounded with that team song for the last couple of minutes. All right, next up is more Foxbox. Oh, good. It's time for Cubics, the donut shop. Robots for everyone? Yeah. Thank you, Ultimo, for the 500 Ultramans. Man, that went way off screen. That looks cool. <laughs> Hold on. Well, 
Welcome to the donut shop. The donut shop is where all your dreams come true here in the Cubics world. Well, see if you can help Graham quickly catch all donuts. The more you catch, the higher the score. Use your mouse to move Graham to left and right and beat the championship score of 500. Think I can do it? Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> this! What do you think? How did it look worse than all the other Fox Box games we've seen? How do the standards keep getting lower? There's, he's not even animated. It's fine. Holy shit. How do you fuck up Kaboom so bad? Yeah, he's got a shadow, a kind of weird looking one, but it's there. What is going on? I can't even tell. I'm getting donuts, honey. All right. But the sound effects imply you're playing tennis. It's fine. What? Are you are you, is your brain normal? Oh, Cartoon Network C and D, the uh the Cartoon Network MMO relaunch. That sucks. Boo. Of course they would, losers. Yeah, you're ten percent of the way to the championship score. Can we convince uh, Marp to add Flash games? <laughs> Can we get some high score tracking for these? One more round. <laughs> this is fucking dire. I've never seen anything worse than this. The championship score, yeah, it was 500. So, uh, good luck to you. Or yeah, retro achievements for this shit. I think if, if you can get 500 in this game, Prove it. I want to see it. This is one of the hardest games. Like, I cannot even imagine getting... being able to get that score. There was just no care and no love made This is this. the bottom of the barrel. There's nothing good about this. Simpsons Prison Break looks like... Like I said, it looks so genius in comparison. Let's, let's have Cubic sent to prison for this. Okay. Is this the worst thing ever streamed on a Multimedia Monday? We've Maybe. done 3DO. We've done CDI. Uh, even CDI games kind of make this look like a big piece of shit. Yeah, no, I'd rather play, like... Even the Peter Sellers intro screen looks better than this. <laughs> if I make it to 100... I might... I might make it to 100, folks! I got 100! Oh my god, you're a fifth of the way there. Oh, I remember the uh, the horror-themed uh, Scary House Garfield Flash game. Was that the one where you find Lyman tied up in the basement? Yeah, I remember that. All right, that is Cubics. Robots okay. for no one. 126 is Alex's high score. If you beat it, post it to the Discord. All right, it's time for the final... Uh... Oh, my God, which one was this? It's time for the final... Uh... Final uh, ad break. It's okay. It's time for Sprite one-on-one -on -one challenge. Challenge Sprite. Do you get a power-up that turns you into a McDonald's Sprite? God, I wish. I love McDonald's Sprite. Alex is hooked. I am! I can't eat... I, I The only things I can really eat gluten-free there at McDonald's are, like, drinks and, um... Milk. Yeah, let's see how this compares to the 7-Up Spot games. They got some real competition out there. So, so it's... So, uh, what do you think this game is going to be like? What team do we want to be? We want to be, of course, the Longhorns. <laughs> well, it's not a TV show. This is an ad break. Yeah, it's an ad break. We got to have ad breaks if we're going to cover TV shows. Hold it on. popped up switched. a second window. Yeah, give me a... There we go. <laughs> this thing keeps opening new windows. I have to let the three... The, the player initialize. Okay. Give it a minute. Hold on. Install. What are you installing on my computer, Alex? It's fine. Are you... Sh Wait a minute. It's fine. <laughs> Is that Windows Defender? No. Don't disable my antivirus, Alex. I'm not. Don't give it root access. Don't give it administrator privileges. It's what the fine. I love doing this. Flashpoint has to close. Don't let it format the drive, Alex. It's fine. 
It's good when drives get formatted. Now let me have some of this delicious Monster Energy drink brought to you by Monster. <laughs> Remember when you uh, spilled a Rockstar Energy on the computer and it yeah, shut it off? <laughs> Literal moments in Retro Pals history. I was thinking about that the okay, other day. Okay, now it should work. <clears throat> Cartman, thank you for the 100 bits. System32.exe removed. Who needs it? There we go. Hold on, I gotta switch... Uh... The people are still hearing that. <laughs> what do you think? What have you done? It's fine. It works. What did you do? It works fine, honey. Vinny Vinesaw is going to sue. <laughs> this, this is this what Sprite does to you? I don't. <laughs> okay. I don't know if uh, this is the best best way to portray the brand. Folks, we got bad news. Did it die? <laughs> it died horribly. It did not die peacefully. You you gave it that game the most horrible death it possible. It crashed. It's frozen. We got to control alt delete this. We actually do. Holy fuck! I think that actually probably <laughs> that looks like it might. Have a chance of bricking my computer, so thank you, Alex. <laughs> it took out Flashpoint. That was pretty. Good. It's not even loading all the other games. There we go. There we go. We're back. We're back. So that was the Sprite One on One Challenge. Wow! Right? Great commercial break. We almost died. <laughs> all right, we're getting near the end. Danny, do you remember the uh, syndicated show Roar? Absolutely not. Ultimo, thank you for the hundred bits. Thank you. Magic moves will keep shining through. Here's some more fake shit Alex made up. My poor computer. I didn't do anything. You installed like 12 viruses just I to make that work for five seconds. Viruses, huh? Listen, <laughs> roar of the land, roar of the people. A voice that echoes through every living thing and is the power of life. Okay? okay. Do you hear that? Yeah, all right. Roar, the online adventure by the makers of the Xena online adventure. Fake. So fake. So, you are commanding a shit. band of warriors that must invade and conquer the enemy's fort. You control one warrior at a time as he rushes towards a fort. Avoid the arrows and uh, reach the post safely. Gotta jump over the rocks, too. I only have 40 warriors. R run, spacebar jumps. Got it. Let's go. It appears we have a classic-styled platformer. Hmm, yeah, this is from the Xena devs, all right. Yeah, we can we can put the music back on now that it's not just noise. How do I jump? We got one. Nine more warriors needed. Two. Yeah, shoot. We No oh. I died. Shoot me. Shocked by E Zone. It does say that. <laughs> Is that what they called it back then when they made a shockwave adaptation of something they called it shocked by? They should have done that. Is this Defender of the Crown at home? I said that about the, the Xena game too. There's just something Defender of the Crown ish about these games. Damn. Or yeah, Hacksword by this is just a, a C64 you intro. Was good. You're doing good. I can't wait to see what happens when you get all the warriors there. I actually haven't done it, so... Well, careful, you only have 36 warriors left. <laughs> they all just stand there single file. Line them up, boys. The guys down there are talking Dude. shit up to the archer right now, like, we're gonna get you, we're gonna find you, and we're gonna beat you up. It's fine. Reverse flicky. This could use some goofy oh. Dark Castle sound effects. Oh. It's just a horse. Look at this guy, I hate him! These two warriors! 
Yeah, I love the archer just standing there being like, I don't I don't see those those guys. They don't exist to me. That makes his life harder, man. Fuck. Oh, that's right. We did it! Is that good? Victory! Yay! Number one victory royale! Yeah! Yeah, Fortnite, we about to get down. Cheer the Central on Fox. I won't be doing that. I won't. You guess how many episodes the series lasted? Uh, two. Eight. <laughs> it's almost two. I don't uh, think anyone watched this. This is a thing that came and went, and no one paid attention. Yeah. Not even the people who usually watch shit like this remember this. Wow. Yeah, no one remembers Roar. That's impressive. Rachel's parents watched this. Wow. Oh, nice. Okay, it did exist. I'm always glad to get at least one confirmation that it exists. So. I know that Alex isn't trying to fuck with me. Are you for last but not least? Yes. Last what do you got? Game. Really? <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> Folks, we did Xena the online adventure. We did Roar the online adventure. There's one more universal property with an online adventure. <laughs> and it's Leave It to Beaver. How? What? Why? What? Huh? How? I want that bike more than anything I ever wanted. The beaver's brand new bicycle has been stolen by the town bully. The bully has ridden the bike into the park and has hidden it behind some bushes. Help Beef by guiding him through the park to recover his bike. But watch out, the bully is also in the park. And if he catches beaver, he'll chase him back to the start. We gotta help the beef. Hey. This looks great already. Help Beaver through the mazes. You must help Beaver. So is this also just Defender of the Crown? <laughs> it does remind me of Beethoven's second for Super Nintendo. This is shit. This fuck off. Fuck off. Get the fuck out of here. Tell me you make a Leave It to Beaver game and you have it look like this. Go to hell. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Leave It to Beaver online adventure shocked by E Zone. I'm shocked, all right. This Dr. Doolittle PS2 ass game. Now this is a blast entertainment game. I get stuck on walls a lot. They left development to Beaver. <laughs> you shouldn't leave anything to Beaver, really. Go get the football, Beav. You gotta get the football. Oh, Beav, you got the football. Now you get to move on. We've all been shocked by E-Zone today. There's the bully. I like this epic cinematic version of the Leave it to Beaver theme. <laughs> Why hasn't this been rebooted again? Where's the Leave it to Beaver cinematic universe? This is Beaver gear. I don't. I don't get. Do the, it, holy shit! I don't get the level design either. It doesn't make a lot of sense to me. Congratulations! You helped Beaver get his bike back. Way to go, fucko! Buy the video. freaking video. <laughs> only 1998. This game's so old. It's advertising a video cassette. <laughs> wow. You know. Script for a second. Yeah, all right. I think there's. I think. I think there might be a second Leave It, Leave it to Beaver game, if I recall. What? Yes, there is. Oh all my right. god, we're going into overtime with a previously unseen Leave It to Beaver sequel. No, these aren't games. They're just uh, quizzes. Never mind. Oh, okay. okay. It's a quiz sorry, about the sorry. old show. I thought there was a second you one. You got me excited there. I got well, really excited. Thankfully, that's the last we've seen of the E-Zone. Uh, we've all been shocked by them. Leave it to Beaver was shocked by them. Xena Warrior Princess, shocked by E-Zone. Frankly, I've been shocked by what I see today. I'm very shocked. I've seen yeah. <laughs> so much horrible, perverse bullshit on the stream today. Uh, thank you, Alex, for that great lineup of Shockwave Flash games. I appreciate it. Was it great? It was, um, well, some people watched it, <laughs> and they're still here. So who can say, really? Uh, that's about uh, 
That is a that is a shit ton of shockwave flash games or just flash games based on classic television shows. Did you like it? I loved it. Thank you, Alex. <laughs> that was incredible. What? That one company who just kept making the same game over and over, and it was garbage. What? I like that. How'd they get away with that? And these games are so old, like 1997, 98? Jesus. Yeah. <laughs> I love the, the one that was advertising uh, Holyfield Tyson 2. <laughs> I love that, too. But you wouldn't believe what the noise I made when that when I saw that. I was like, fuck! Yeah, the Bob and Weave series was going strong with a fourth game, and then suddenly... Suddenly, something happened that made them end the series. <laughs> it had to canceled. They got canceled just out of nowhere. We'll never know what happened. Thanks, everybody, for watching. Thank this you. has been another Demented edition of Multimedia Monday. Thanks to Alex. Yeah, I'm demented. Good work. Good Thank work. You. We'll you. be back on Wednesday with what our patrons voted to see, which is a complete playthrough of Paris Dakar Rally Special for Famicom. What? This is a This is a classic Kusoge. This is an amazing game. Alex, if you've never seen this before... Prepare to have your ass blown to pieces. Well, if my ass didn't get blown to pieces by uh, Ultimate Muscle Gassy Shooting Gallery, I guess I'll be blown to pieces <laughs> by this. I guess so. We also have a uh, intro slash pitch video up on YouTube. Yeah, if you're yeah, new yeah. to the show and want to learn about what we're all about, the kind of things we stream, we don't just stream Flash games. We stream all kinds of other bullshit. Go to our YouTube channel. Watch the new video. Check it out. Watch the whole thing. See if you can uh, join the Retro Pals community. Or just, get, or just get disgusted by what you see and never watch this again. Either, yeah, either way. or. We don't care. I'm looking for a raid target. Alex, so why don't you uh, wrap us up? All right. We, uh, let's see. So as Danny mentioned, we are on YouTube, youtube.com slash RetroPal. That's where you can see our pitch video. Show it to your friends. Show it to your enemies. I, show it to everybody. Go down <laughs> to project it onto City Hall. Do whatever you want. We also have a Discord. Let me just put that link in the chat here. Yes, you survived getting shocked by E-Zone. Get that tattooed on your face. <laughs> um, please join our Discord to get shocked by E-Zone and to discuss the games we've played, uh, discuss old video games in general, emulation, and uh, show off your cats, your dogs, your pets. We want to see them. We want to see them. We love seeing them. Love those pets. And thank you for the welcome back. We uh, It was a wild week last week, but we're back. And it it's, sure it's was. It's good to be back. This Wednesday is going to be a good stream. This is mm -hmm. I always love just tackling one extremely shitty game and seeing that... Uh, front to back we'll be seeing the entire game hopefully i think we can play through the whole thing in two hours I think uh, so. wish us luck so why don't we raid bill bull who is streaming spider the video game for ps1 yes, this is a sick. this is a platformer where you play as a spider who has like a flamethrower and a knife and a machine gun and all mm -hmm. kinds of things very weird very twisted game uh, if you're weird and twisted like us i think you'll enjoy it so have a good rest of your day we'll see you later thanks for watching see ya folks